Hello and welcome to my third episode of Borderlands Theme of the Year Edition. Um, in this episode, obviously, uh, as you'll find out, my microphone was acting a little weird, so the voices for it might be a little off, as you uh, might not be able to hear it very well, but yeah. I managed to fix it after I recorded most of the clips, so I think the last clip and then the intro and the outro are all better, but um, yeah, for future episodes that should be fixed. But we take out a good amount of quests, well I mean we took out I think 5 quests, 6 quests, somewhere on there, but um, I feel like the way I was doing it wasn't the best way. So I changed it up a bit so that there's a lot more killing the enemies and a lot less just turning in the quests and accepting them. Anyway, enjoy the episode and let me know what you think. Alright. The first quest of this episode is Circle of Death, Meet and Greet. We had to meet uh, this guy right in front of me, Raid Saban, and now we will do the Round of Death, Round 1. Spawn real quick. in real quick. Start round two, I believe. Help us guys are pain. Just because they got so much armor. If I had corrosive, they'd be slightly easier. Quest in, grab the next one, and grab some more repeater ammo. Oh, last one is level 18. We're gonna make our way over to the sniper rifle quest and kill all these snipers. Oh, that hurt! This, this guy is annoying. Looks like having some... another soldier on the field. Oh, I'm stuck there. I'm so sad. That would have sucked. That's enough. Well, those eggs are dead. I think there's more right up here. are all dead. Go up here, kill these bandits real quick. Right, you lost! Get your ass gone! <laughs> 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 more, more me! <laughs> 
wait for me! Just slice him in the face with a sword. Or knife. Alright. Kill this guy. He's dead. I think we gotta go to the right. Go over here. Another dude up there. Blow him up. Alright, boys, take him out! Dead. Sometimes that's a bruiser too. And once in a while I get I get a bruiser that comes out that gate. Oh my god, someone help me! Somebody help me! Nobody can help you, Mr. Bandit. They're all gonna be dead shortly too. As soon as I shoot them, they run away. At least for the most part. I don't understand that uh, coding or whatever the hell it is that causes them to run away as soon as you shoot them. Oh no, I got shot. I gotta run away. Goodbye, Mr. Bandit. I thought I saw one here. Okay, so there's one down there that I just got, which was the site. I think there might be one over here. Don't see any sniper rifle parts over here. Could never remember where these damn things are. I used to know where they were on the, um, the 360 version, uh, the original version without the game of the year. But uh, oh, here's one. I think they might have slightly changed up the spots with them. Either that or I'm just wrong. It's really yeah. possible. Oh, there's the third one. Where would the last one be? No. There's a gun on the ground behind me. Oh, there it is. That's pretty cool. Got all the uh, sniper parts. And now we can go and try and kill Mo and Marley. And be there in a second. Clearing out these uh, spikes near the bottom of where we are at. We're at level 15. It's pretty nice. It's Critical so it's stronger, so Mo and Marley will not be as annoying to fight. So we'll just put the point in real quick. Um, yeah, we'll put in Namor again. You can always use that, you know? Mr. Sky. Alright, let's go kill that Mo and Marley. Should be right up there. Okay, now let's go kill Mo and Marley. I had to kill the other little Skag that was over there. Look at that. This is the right there, but they're not there. Are they down here? There they are. Badass, no. There's Marley. 
Oh, that one's a badass. Gross as well. Hey, Marley. Yeah, you can have that. I don't know where Marley is. Skag's constantly attacking me. Makes a little bit of an annoyance here. As if you get hit when you're trying to aim, your gun just skyrockets into the air. Come on, Marley. Let's die. So, we keeping score here. He's got 9,100 experience from killing this thing. Nice transfusion grenade. There's more. No. Let's reload it a bit. damage because I'm kind of shooting at it from the front. Oh, oh yeah, kind that was all me. Dead there, Mo. Poor Skag. Anyway, that's Mo and Marley. And Marley was a lot more difficult than Mo was. Mostly because I had all the little ones attacking me. Anyway. Go ahead and turn these quests in real quick. Alright, now we're back to the bounty board to turn in the quests. We got more experience from killing Marley than we did from turning this in. But we got 6120 experience. Break it up! Mod. Or not mod, artifact, sorry. And we have this one for the sniper rifle. We get 1932 experience from the sniper rifle. Happens to be fire for me. I don't know what it is for everybody else. But, activate this artifact so it goes in here, so your skill will be elemental based. So the first one you normally get is fire. So every time my turret shoots, it'll do uh, fire damage. Also, we love it. So we will put a point into... Uh, yeah, we'll just keep upgrading this. Anyway, go to the next quest. Here's the Cloud Trout's repair kit up on this bridge we just went under a couple of seconds ago. Um, I will see you in a second to turn the quest in. Next, turn the quest to the Cloud Trout. So we get to search back up here. Right here gives you three spaces. Let's see, I'm at 12. Now I'm at 15. Go back here to turn the Shock Crystal Harvest in for a shock artifact. Looks like we have shock damage on our skill ability. It's good. It also gives us 36-72 experience. Alright, now the next quest will be the mine gate key for sludge. Alright, so we're gonna go and try this final round again now that we're level 18. Shouldn't be too difficult. Got upgraded weapons, 
Yeah, more damage since we're the same level as these enemies now. Ow. Also, we have more HP and a better shield, so I think we're all set now. Oh yeah, much better. We didn't kill the level 18 yet, but taking out all the level 15 rather easily. Probably should have saved my turret for when the 18 spawns. There's a 15. There's a 15. How are you stuck? Uh, how were you stuck, I guess I should say. Alright, here's our first level 18. Unite them both on fire. That way they're slowly both dying. Oop, I didn't hit him on fire, did I? No, oh, that one doesn't want to light on fire, dude. Oh, we killed that one. Dude, stop running in circles. It makes it harder to aim at you. There we go, he dead. Nice. A lot easier. Level 14 did not work very well. Level 18, easy. Alright, let's go turn this in. <clears throat> and there we go. Turn that in for 4,896.12 cash. And I got a combat rifle, which is kind of crap for what my level is. Anyway, um, yeah, let's go to the next, next quest. And this is the end of episode 3 of Borderlands Game of the Year edition. Um, yeah, so like I said, my, my microphone obviously was a little wonky. But next episode it will be a lot better as I fixed it. But unfortunately, I couldn't go back through the quests with this character and redo the um, recording for it. So, that's that. Um, yeah, so next episode we will be going and killing Sledge. I was going to try and cram it into this episode, but it was getting eh, decently long. And with how I plan on doing the quests for this episode forward, um... The quest would have taken probably 10-15 minutes to complete. So, yeah, I don't think it would have fit within within the time frame I wanted. Anyway, um, if you're enjoying the content, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I also stream on Twitch at Cloud999666 Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time till midnight. So it's like a four hour stream for now. And yeah, I'd greatly appreciate it if any of you guys just stopped in and said hi. Alright, have a good night. Bye.